Maybe at the start there was. Yeah. I won't like you. Don't just fall out of love with someone like that after three and a half The boy I went to couple up with is. Do you not want to try and make it work? I'll be honest, mate. I think she's talking to you. You're getting upset because you're feeling so good. Yeah, you're not. Yeah, you're not. 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 you are not 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 you
Jessica, I want you. Oh, guys, can we just move on? Cause my heart breaks a little when I hear your name. It all just sounds like. I really hope that uh, Molly and Callum actually get back with each other now. Yeah. Genuinely, yeah. Because I actually wanted them to show their first ever, because I've seen it on TikTok, um, the clips of Callum wanting Molly in the mm. villa. It's like, oh, she's so beautiful. Like, mm. really, really. Like, I want them to show that clip to them. But so I, I do think that Callum's completely done with that. You reckon? Yeah. Is he checked out? I, I, as a man to man, looking at him and the way Does the he way he says things, is he in his and it's also it's the eye, the eyes never lie. Like usually, you can tell if you've still got a twinkle for someone. Oh yeah, well this is what all the podcast clips comments say. You can just tell by the way. Yeah, he looks, uh, doesn't love well, you, you can just tell, mate. Calamine, in on that. Oh. Yeah, he, I don't think he wants to get back. But I think that they reached their end for a, a reason. Mm. Um, and. Yeah, fuck it. See what happens. Mm. But yeah, he he uh, he's cool, man. I like the way he handles because he just he's like oh, he's funny. Often. Yeah, he's funny. <laughs> no, I, I rate it. Like he's a good looking man. Yeah, he's he also sees things as literally just black and white. Yeah, which is which quite is nice. It's really helpful. Yeah. It's really helpful. I still want to be have a good relationship. You know? But that be as a friend of all. But I think a friendship is well off the car. First you both go out your way in the vibe is feeling strong and with small turn to a friendship, a friendship turn to a bond and that bond will never be broken. The love will never get lost. Again! Again! The public are, for some reason, backing Callum and Molly getting Liv back didn't together. didn't say it. But Brad said it in the background, basically. Well, obviously, obviously, something's been seen then. It was brought up in mine, it was brought up in Molly's, and it was brought up in um, the one with Jess and Demi. Yeah. But well, I, well, that's it's not, Tom. Don't don't start being like it's not at all because I know. I even sat Molly but down. I'm not afraid if it's coming from three. No, different... but no, because you've got to look. You've got to think. Can of... I just say? Can I just say? I think you've got to remember the public love Molly. And they the love Callum. The public Callum. love Callum. They've seen them get together in a previous series where they followed their entire journey. Mm. Obviously, for the public, are like they're backing it. I sat on this bed last night with Molly. She was quite quiet last night after she got a bit teary because of the whole G situation. Basically, G obviously when she said about her date and how amazing Anton's been, Molly then got a bit upset. That was the reason she was quiet. It wasn't anything to do with you. Well, that, that's just. But how is it? 
You've not done anything wrong. No, I've not even done anything but it's not nice to hear Arabella, do you know what I mean? You guys know what you have. We all know what you we have. We all know I what you know have. what you have. No, but it's come from three different no, people. No, but, but it could be some... But yeah, but it's come from three different people because it's in different ways. It, yeah. What I think, ways, though? I don't know. I'll speak to Molly about you, it. You, you need speak to speak to Molly about that. I think she just brought up the AAB. Are you sure there's nothing still with Callum? I think she said that. Who? How is it... it so that's her best friend saying that, you know. So have a conversation. Mm. She's gonna have a conversation with Molly. Mm. What, so if these two get back together then, there's nothing anyone on this planet can tell me yeah. they did that this ain't scripted and they didn't plan this. They're still together, ain't fooling me. I actually cast him as a mate, which is Sad. kind of strange, yeah, but... it's great. Yeah. <laughs> me ex and me, uh... Yeah, boyfriend. Yeah. Huh? Ex and boyfriend, soon to be. Uh... <laughs> Why don't you make That's him, not, again, right, make him your boyfriend sure tonight? Stop. Callum, no, come on. Molly, I love you, but I'm sorry. Do you really think Tom, who seems like there is absolutely no thoughts going on in his head, thought about the dog Teddy and the whole Valentine set up by himself? And then later on, the boys are all chatting around the fire pit and Tom's like, oh, she missed the dog, so obviously, like, I got the dog Teddy, blah, blah, blah. And Callum's actually sat next to him like, I literally told you to do that. I don't know if Tom just forgot. It wasn't his own idea. Or if he's, like, taking a a page out of George's book and is saying something so much so that he then starts to believe that it's true. I know that we've only got one week left, but when you're a Molly and Callum fan, sometimes you have to actively choose to live in delusion and hope that they're still going to get back together anyway somehow. The same way that I'm choosing to believe that the real reason Molly cried when Arabella was asking if she was okay is because she actually wants Callum back. Also, let's think about the fact that Molly and Callum are spending their first Valentine's Day after breaking up together, but apart. When Jess had a video call and she was like, am I standing in the way of true love? Yes, Jess, please, step aside. On the first look tonight, Tom already looks fuming about people talking about Callum and Molly. So can you imagine when he exits the villa and his entire phone is just Callum and Molly edits and everyone's saying that he's dry? If I can take anything from this experience, it's that we've actually got a friendship now yeah. because on the outside we, we, we didn't have that. We wouldn't have had that, now. And I feel like... Even like my mum and dad, like, they've not been together for like 12, 13 years. Mm. And they're still friends. So for yeah. me, like, that's just a normal thing to do. But yeah, like I said, I'm, I'm happy that you found Tom. Like, he makes, he looks like he makes you all happier. <laughs> no, 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 no. I mean, like, he looks like he makes you, he looks like he makes you really happy. And I'm, I'm just, yeah, it's nice to see. And I'm happy that you've got Jess. And it's great, I, I'm, I'm enjoying it. But we would never have come to this on the outside. And yeah, I feel like I'm just, yeah, in a good place. Cleared it up? Yeah. yeah. Cleared it up. What do we do? What do we do as friends? <laughs> what do we do as friends? We, shake hands. If we hug, would that be weird? Should we shake hands? I mean, Is shake... that going to be read into too much? Yeah, don't look in my eyes. Oh my gosh, should we just do this? Me. Should we just do that? Great. Okay, so that'll be yeah. a great chat. Well, and this one's for you. When's our anniversary? <laughs> when is it? Go on. 12th of April. Hey, well done. <laughs> It was all about when worth it. It was. Are you sure? Of course it was. Good answer. Well done. <laughs> when are you going to pop the question? What's the question? What do you want for tea? <laughs> I disagree. He works out the most. In quarantine, you. So I don't, wait, I'm, in quarantine? I'm always, I'm always in the gym. I don't know if you are. Yeah, exactly. So you can't say in quarantine. Well, yeah, in, but right, in quarantine then. I've, yeah, I work out almost. Yeah. You've not done one workout. I've done, I've run this morning. <laughs> For five minutes? You made it to the end Doesn't of the drive back, and back turned back. Hurting. Back was hurting. Excuses. Right. Excuses. Is it is a contentious, contentious question. Is what does contentious mean? A, trick, a sticky one. Not, Who is the best driver? <laughs> oh. Not as easy. <laughs> that was an Honestly, easy one. I, I don't know if I should tell you this, but she does tend to do like forties around this estate. <laughs> I'm like, you're gonna have to slow down, you're gonna hit the child. Honestly, it's, it scares me. Yeah. It makes me sick. <laughs> no, the only reason why I voted for you is because you always say that you get car sickness. Because well, you're it's your driving, honestly, lad. It's oh, it's it erratic. Mm -hmm. It's not erratic. I've just got places to be, people to see. Yeah, and kids to kill as well. <laughs> Right. <laughs> Who's the cleverest? Yeah. I'm gonna say me. How do you know though? Because with that family quiz the other night, it depends. In, ten, in terms of depending, like academically, you're probably better, but 
You've got a lot of useless, um, useless yeah, knowledge. Yeah, he stores random facts. A lot of random, pointless facts. Facts, but that come up. Last question: Who is the most romantic? Me, is it? She's definitely not you. Oh, no. I mean, I'm not really romantic. No, you're, you're right. Not, you're not, are you? Well, you're not like rom. Mm. No, um. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you bought me flowers and stuff. Yeah, exactly. Quite that was romantic. Good, yeah. I bought flowers in the pouring rain. Living with how are you? It's driving me insane. You agree? Living with me is yeah. driving you insane. <laughs> the walls. Well, you agreed on eight. When we say we only watched All Stars for Callum and Molly, we really mean it. Possibly the closest vote in all of Love Island history. Molly and Tom only won by 2%. Georgia and Anton's votes were just from his mum. Georgia S and Toby's were only Tyreek and Ella. And then there leaves about 15% of the UK that voted for actual connection.